Yes, next is back tonight. We're going to boot straight into Haiku, our install system, as I said did it before. And we installed a bit earlier, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. See how quick that boots. It's quicker than a quick thing down a quick lane down a quick road going up a quick sky, isn't it? Ooh, quick. Okay. Right. <clears throat> we're a good look around on the first one. We installed it on the second one. This one, I'm just going to show you how to install other packages. Now, there is no repos as such in Haiku. You go to the internet, download them, and install them that way. Now, I could be here sometime and do a long video and put them in the right menus and that, but all I'm going to do now is unpack them to the desktop and open them from here. So as you can see, I've got apps up here. Open up for you. I've got Bzilla, which is a Firefox clone, okay? So I'll just open up for you. Here we are, Bzilla. Or Boneco, actually, is, is mainly the one now. And there we go. It's not too bad, but I think their own one, Web Positive, is faster, okay? I think it's faster, personally and looks a lot better but there are other ones out there including aurora which works really really fast so that's good too okay okay so goodbye we're going to go from now go away and we'll get rid of that <clears throat> now normally you would actually wouldn't keep them to the desktop you put them in their own folders and they could put them in the menus but i'm just not going to do that i'm going to make this a real short video okay so what i'm going to do we're going to go down to applications I'm going to have to web positive, which is their web browser. Open that one up. By the way, before anybody asks, the reason I'm doing a little set of haiku videos is Alpha 4 comes out quite soon. So it should get you all in the mood for trying the new Alpha 4 out and see what you reckon. Because apparently, the word on the street, or on the web, says it's pretty, pretty damn good. Okay? Okay. So I'll go to my bookmarks, and I've down... Um, I've just took on to Haikuware, which is one of the sites you can go to to download stuff for haiku. Okay, so we are. There's lots of stuff here. Development drivers, emulators, entertainment, games, geek toys, blah, 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 blah. But as I'm doing this really quick, we're going to go to multimedia. Yes, indeedy. We're going to go to video. And go to recording. So say you want to do a bit of screen capturing in Haiku. Okay, yes, it can be done. It's called B Screen Capture for Haiku. So what we're going to do, we're going to download this baby here. We're going to install it and just do a, lot, a quick 10 second video in Haiku. So we're going to download it, just click once for download. You just wait, and yeah, it's done. All done. That was really quick, wasn't it? Did you see that? It was really quick. So I'll close it down. I'll close our web positive browser. And then you can see up in the top here, B screen captures zip. All you do, double click it. Okay, here comes the expander. Then normally you would set where you want it to put the thing. But I'm just going to do it to desktop just for quickness and just to show you what you can do. Okay, so we're going to expand that. And we're done. And there it is there. So we're going to open it up. Double click. And we're going to go to GCC2 because I had trouble with the 4. Okay, so we'll open them up. There we go. We're going to encode to MPEG4, AVI file, boot home, output file. Yeah, that's fine by me. <clears throat> so we're going to start recording. Okay, you ready? First one, and off we go. And now we are actually recording our desktop. And as you can see, up in the corner here, we got a lot of activity going down in the hood. Oh, yes. So, was that long enough? Yeah, sorry, we'll close that. So, that one's gone. And we're going to stop recording. Okay, we're done. It's encoding the movie. A bit like Record My Desktop, I suppose, in one sense or another. Okay, so that's going along, going along. I've not got into the advanced options and the processing stuff. You can do all that yourself, especially once the new Alpha 4 comes out tomorrow, which it won't be again, okay? It won't be. So, let's see where I put that, shall I? Now, there it is, my output file. Should we play it? Yes, we will. Double click on it. And there you go. And there's your screencasting video of Haiku in Haiku, super e dupery of the duper. Okay, there's lots of options you can change in it to make it really, really good, but that's entirely up to you what you want to do at the end of it. Yes, it is. Yeah, come on. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to Web Positive again. Okay, <clears throat> so go out to Applications. I just prefer their own browser actually, the other ones I've tried are just not as quick. Yeah, but I'm only the messenger, don't shoot me. Okay, we'll go back to our bookmarks again. We'll go to Haiku Software or Haiku Wear. And I'll just go through a couple of bits and bobs with you while you're here. There's games, so I'll go to games, there's some stuff you can get here, like 2D, 3D, cars, children, so I'll go to children's games, you'll see what I mean. Anagram, 
Nice little one, it's okay. Baby B. The toddler's for six months and up. Very simple, let's just hold press any key on the keyboard and mouse and click anywhere. Yeah, it's super duper, eh? lovely, jubbly stuff. Yeah, so yeah, there's lots and lots of stuff you can get for Haiku, and it's really easy to install. It's really, really quick, but there are no repos, so there might be some dodgy ones out there, but you'll never know. But as it only takes four to eight minutes or ten minutes to install, no big deal, really, is it? And most of the programs are all zipped up for you anyway. So yeah, so yeah, that's downloading, using, and installing stuff in Haiku. Super duper, sneaky, a Linux, a going out. I'll see you later. Bye bye.